to get your serial number, you're going to want to go in the back end of your Video Hive account. And there you can download a PDF or text. And inside that PDF or text, you are going to see an item purchase code. Now that item purchase code is what you want to copy and paste as your serial number into Premiere Pro FX. To launch Premiere Pro FX, we're going to go up top to Window, Extensions, and there we're going to see Premiere Pro FX extension. Now the first time you launch it, this is where you want to copy and paste your registration code. Hit register. Now again, this may take a minute or two. There's over 10,000 elements and effects, so it's got to unpack everything into the system. And once that's done, hit OK. Now for Mac, this is going to run you through just the couple security measures so that you want to check on Premiere Pro for 2021, 2022, and you want to check on the security and privacy, and then make sure you have those checked on. And once that's done, it's going to close out the extension, and you just want to relaunch the extension. Now you hit this launch app button, and you'll be good to go. Now here's just a quick interface overview. Up top here, we're going to have our favorites. So if we select this little star icon in each effect, that's going to launch our favorites category. Next to it, we have a search bar. So if we want to search something like glitches, we just go in the search bar there and it's going to call up all the different effects. Next to that, the little play button is actually going to be the tutorials page. So you can click that button to access all the tutorials. And right next to that is the audio on or off button. So we can check this on or off. You may or may not want effects with audio. You can just check off the audio right there. Now down below here, we have this little scroll bar, which is going to allow us to decrease or increase the size of the thumbnails. And then over to the right here is a preview all. So if you hit this, you can kind of get an idea of all the effects. And you're going to notice in the middle up top, it's going to give you the name of each effect. So if I highlight the effect, it's going to show me a big preview of that effect. And it's also going to give me the name of that effect. And that's it. Enjoy.